So this question says the scatter plot shows the relationship between two variables, x and y. A line of best fit is also shown. So we see the line of best fit. We see the scatter plots all around the line of best fit. Some are on it, some are below, some are above. The question goes on to say, what is an equation of the line of best fit? All right, so again, on this test, anytime you see equation of a line, we're thinking about that equation in slope-intercept form. So that becomes y equals mx plus b. I always like to focus on the b first because that's the easiest thing to see visually. Our b represents the y-intercept. The y-intercept is right here, right below 4, positive 4, which means that no, it's not at 1.3, so that's gone. And no, for choice D as well, it's not at 1.3, so that's also gone. Don't be confused. This ans these answers have just been rearranged a little bit, so they're, re they're written in Y equals B plus MX form. But it's the same thing as this, okay? So we know that 3.7 is a good Y intercept given what we see on the actual graph. Now the next question is, well, what do I have left for those two answer choices? So I have a positive 1.3 for my slope, right, the M portion here, or I have a negative, I have a negative M. Is my line positive or negative? Well, it's going up and to the right for me to get from point to point, so that makes it a positive slope, and therefore choice A must be the correct answer. No need to actually calculate the slope. All we cared about was visually recognizing where the y-intercept is and whether or not the slope is positive or negative.